the final of SBI Presents CBSE Heritage India Quiz 2014. This is a show where we ask some easy questions to teams from across the country who give their difficult answers as we marvel at the depth of their knowledge. Taking you through this exciting journey is me, Ajay Punya, and with me are five bright and young school teams. They admire our heritage, they're proud of India, and they love to quiz. And that is why they are national semi-finalists. As team one, we have Balbharti Public School, Noida. As team two, we have Little Flower School, Gohati. As team three, we have Bhavan's Newsprint Vidyale from Vellur. As team 4, we have Bayanan Public School from Shimla. And as team 5, DAV Public School, Jamshedpur. So that's a very strong group club together. As they say, winning isn't everything. It's the only thing. The first round is called Chanakya Niti. Here are the rules. 10 questions, 5 clockwise, 5 anti-clockwise. The Niti that you have to figure out is when to make use of the buzzers as we play hangman alongside. And we play two of them. Clear? Here's the first hangman. One word, 10 letters. Right, nobody of course going for the buzzer. Here's the first question. This is for team 1, Balbharti Public School, Noida. Look at the visual and answer the question that follows. The Maulana who loved Krishna wrote Outlook India about which poet who also coined a revolutionary chant with his verse Kuch humko bhi aata ho ke ay hazrat e Krishna hazrat ki bhi kubul ho matura mein hazri Sunte hai aashikon pe tumhara karam hai khas Maulana Abdul Kalam Azad Maulana Abdul Kalam Azad is incorrect Little Flower School Gohati team 2 Salim Chishti. Salim Chishti. Mm -hmm. Round timeline. Sudas. Again, round timeline. Team 4. Uh, this is the person who wrote uh, a Gita in Urdu and his name is Divana. Uh, is incorrect as well. Maulana Hazrat Modi. And the revolutionary chant. In Kalab Is the answer. This is Hazrat Mohani. Very, very good answer. Gets you. 10 points, DAV Public School, Jamshedpur opening the account in the third semi-final. Hasrat Mohani, H. Here's the first letter. Divided into Poof and Uttar. The fourth letter is H. No. Next question is a direct question for Balbharti Public School, Noida. This is yours. This species gets its name from the bulbous growth on the tip of the male's snout, which is called blank, meaning pot in Hindi. Name this critically endangered species that is being conserved by a gentleman called Romulus Viteka. In one. The? Gharyal. The Gharyal. It is good answer, Balbharti Public School. You get 10 points. G. G is what we get. Next question. First English translation by Horace Haven Wilson. Third letter. In four, the Anand Public School Shimla has gone for it. What is your answer? 15 make, points. Make do them. Make do them. Do them. Does it fit in 10 letters? Of course it does fit. 15 points to you, the Anand Public School Shimla. What a lovely answer with make do them. That brings an end to the buzzers in the first part. All right. Only a few direct questions and a few past questions. Right, next question. Little Flower School Gohati, this is yours. Watch the video, question follows. <laughs> Siddharamaya, as the Chief Minister of Karnataka, what was unusual about his oath? He did not start with the uh, saying with the God. He did not start with the God. God, something he missed out in, the, in, his, in his speech. Can you please rephrase your answer? He did not say my God in his first And what did he say? No. No. Moving on. Team 3. Uh, it's the first one to hell outside the legislature assembly. Is incorrect. Team 4. Uh, he addressed not in uh, like this. Uh, I he addressed from the whole people of his name. Uh, like that, that right? Okay, incorrect. Team 5. It was not in the in the English or the Hindi language, it was in the local language that is spoken in Karnataka. Incorrect. Team 1. Uh, it was in Tulu language. 
is incorrect as well. The right answer, I was waiting for Little Flower to work on their answer and give me a better answer. He did not uh, swear in on God, but he took the oath in the name of truth. Next question is a direct question for team 3. Located in the Bhagwan Mahavir Sanctuary and Moolam National Park, identify this beautiful waterfall. Sagar. Please say that again. Sagar. Dut Sagar in Goa. That's the answer. Bhagwan Newsprint Vidyale. You get 10 points. It's in Goa, River Mandovi. Last question of this part of the first round is for team 4. In which present day state, Sage Parshura washed away his sin, Sage Vyas meditated, Lord Krishna married his consort Rukmini and is referred to as the Prabhu Mountains in the Quran. Which state? Which present day state? Manipur. Present day state is? Manipur. Manipur. Team correct. Team 5. DAV. Madhya Pradesh. Madhya Pradesh is incorrect as well. Team 1. Kerala. Kerala, okay. Auctioning Indian states. Team 2. Arunachal Pradesh. Arunachal Pradesh is the answer. Very good answer. Little Class School, Gohati. It is Arunachal Pradesh. That gets you 10 points. So that brings us to the end of the first part of the first round. We'll take a look at the scores and see which team has made early inroads in the third semi final. So it's a very evenly placed round at the moment. Team 1 is at 10, Team 2 is at 10, Team 3 is at 10, Team 5 is at 10. But leading with a very slender margin of 5, if 5 points is Team 4, the Anand Public School from Shimla. I don't think they will retain this lead for long but only time will tell. We'll take a look at what happens in the subsequent rounds after the end of this short break. Stay with us. Welcome back. You're watching the third semi-final of SBI Presents CBSC Heritage India Quiz 2014. We through with part one of the first round. We will pick action now in the second part. Here's the second hangman. Three words. Nine, six, six. Nine letters, six letters, six letters. Obviously no team is going for it right now. Direct question to team five. This is for you. Representing Sid, Acharya, Arehan, Upadhyay and Sadhu. This flag belongs to fill in the blank. The RSS. RSS is incorrect. Team 4. Is it Baha'i? Is incorrect as well. Team 3. Jainism. Jainism. That's the answer. Bhavan is used with Vidyalaya. This is the flag of Jains. Very, very good. You get your 10 points. Okay. From Jainism, we get J. Work with ASI, Raja Ravi Varma and Carl Hertz, the American magician. Team 4, the Anand Public School, Shimla, they've gone for it again. What is your answer? Dada Sahib Falke. Dada Sahib Falke, but that's only two words. Dudhi Raj, Dudhi Raj, Dada Sahib Falke, Dudhi Raj. I will give that to you. It's Dundi Raj Govind Palke. 15 points to you, Dayanand Public School, Shimla. They're only playing the buzzers. They're not playing the direct and pass, it seems. But very good. I'm sure it serves your purpose. Right. Next question. Established in 1972 and stretching over 10 hectares on the banks of Barali, TP houses more than 500 species of plant and is thus the largest of its kind in Asia. Fill in the blank. Team 2. Not trying? I shall move on then. Team 1. Indian wild ass. Indian wild ass. Largest of its kind in Asia. No. Wrong answer, Bhagwati Public School, PAV Public School, Jamshedpur Team 5, this is yours. Hornbill, Nagaland, Hornbills. More than 500 species of Hornbills. Hornbills. I'm not too sure if we have, there are 500 species of Hornbills. Wrong answer, Team 4, Dhanan. Okay. Okay, that's the answer, Dhanan Public School getting this one as well. This is Orchids, 500 species of Orchids. Very good answer. Next question is Team 3 is correct. Basant Rao and Bekut Rao started a company that owns this domestic sporting powerhouse. What is their surname? Somebody go for it. Don't keep doing you go for it, you go for it. I'll move on otherwise. It's incorrect, I'm afraid. Team 2, Gohati, Little Flask Food. Is it 
Jimkhana. Their surname is Jimkhana. No, Balbati Public School. Salgaokar. Salgaokar is incorrect. Team 5. Tempo. Tempo, Vasant Rao and Vaikunt Rao. Tempo, this is the logo of Tempo Sports Club and not Salgaokar. Very good answer, DAV Public School, Jamshedpur. This is Tempo. Okay, then, ninth question. Here it comes. This is for Team 4. The first rules of this sport were drafted by Deccan Jimkhana in Pune. Since 1963, the man of the tournament receives the Eklavya Award, while the woman of the tournament receives the Rani Lakshmi Bai Award. Tell me the sport. Uh, archery. Archery is incorrect. Team 3, you, you probably were thinking around Eklavya, I'm guessing, but that's the wrong answer. Team 3, this is yours. It is Coco, not Archery. Very good answer, Bhavans. You spent with Dalla Team 3. You get 10 points again. Okay, last question of this round is for Little Flower School Gohati. Watch the video. was the reason why Mani Ratna ended his successful partnership with Illai Raja to start another. Who was his new partner? A.R. Rehman. A.R. Rehman. What kind of partnership are we talking about? Music comp they composed the music of this ad. He liked the music composed by A.R. Rehman in this ad of Leo Coffee. Very, very good answer, team 2 Little Flower School Gohati. That gets you 10 points as well. Right then, that brings us to the end of round 1. We will continue with the second round. This is called Shatabdi Express. I'll tell you how this Shatabdi Express works. There will be a total of 4 questions common to all the teams on the buzzer. Each question will have 3 hints. Remember, only 1 buzzer per hint. Should we start? First question. First hint. Nickname of the event that was the brainchild of Inder Singh Grewal in 1933. No one. Next hit. Three day annual event near Ludhiana. I'm looking for the nickname. Team 1 has gone for it. 10 points if you Rural Olympics. Rural Olympics it is. Very good answer. This is Rural Olympics. Brainchild of Inder Singh Grewal in 1933. Rural Olympics. Balbarti Public School. You get 10 points. Next question. First hit. In 1950, the word game was dropped to rid the name of any hunting ideas. No one. Moving on, next hint. In 2005, the descendants of the founders were invited for the centenary celebrations. No one yet. Third hint. Team 5, you've gone for it. What is your answer, DAV Public School Jamshedpur? Skeet shooting. Say that again? Skeet, skeet shooting. Skeet shooting. No, that's the wrong answer. Right, that brings us to the end of this question. The right answer was Kazi Ranga Wildlife Sanctuary. So the word game was dropped. It was Kazi Ranga game. In 2005, the descendants of Lord and Lady Curzon were invited for the centenary celebrations. All right, doesn't matter, team five. Next question, this is on the buzzer. Means devotion to the mystic law of the Lotus Sutra. Team one has gone for it. 15 points if you give me the right answer. Baha'i. Baha'i is incorrect minus 5. Next hint. Mantra referred to as Daimoku. No. But yet. I'll move to the third hint. Team 5 has gone for it. Your answer is? Pushpanjali. Pushpanjali. That's the wrong answer. No negatives. Don't worry. The right answer I was looking for is Namyoho Renge Kyo. Okay, the Buddhist chant, the Buddhist mantra, Namyoho Renge Kyo. Okay, last question of this round. So Edwin Rittins designed his princely residence in Delhi in 1928, Team 5. Rashtra Bhati Whose princely residence would that be? His princely residence is the question. Edwin, uh, Lord Irwin. Lord Irwin, minus 5. Next hint. Rank number 6 in the inflation adjusted all time richest people in history. Team 1 has gone for it. Uh, the Nizam Osman Ali Khan of, of Hyderabad is the answer. 10 points to you, Balbati Public School. This is Nizam of Hyderabad, Osman Ali Khan. 
Very good answer, 10 points. Chatabdi Express round has reached its destination as so has round 2. This is a thoroughly exciting format with teams making each other sweat for every point. But will it be a trend or will one team take a flight while the others look up to them when we return on the other side of this short break? Stay with us. Welcome back to SBI Presents CBSE Heritage India Quiz 2014. This is the third semi-final and we threw with two rounds. This is what the scoreboard says. So we have team four, Dhanan Public School Shimla leading at the moment. They are at 40, followed by Pawan's new sprint Vidyale from Vellu. They are at 30. Then we have Barbhati Public School from Noida, team one at 25. Team two, Little Flower Gohati at 20. And team five, DAV at 15. Now here is the round that over the course of last two semi-finals has proved to be the make or break round. Do you want to sail or sink? That is the choice that you have to make in this round called Kabhi Ye, Kabhi Bo. Here are the rules. 10 questions, 5 on the buzzer, 5 on the bonus. After the end of 3 questions, the last 2 questions will only be played by teams which are still in the game. Clear? First question on your screen. Jonbil Mela is a three-day long community fair held on Mark Bihu near Guwahati. The fair is famous for using a certain system for all commercial activity. What system? Team 2. Barter system. The barter system, that's the answer. Little Flower School, Guwahati, a team that belongs to that part of the country, only answering this one correctly. Now, Little Flower School, you've got your 5. What do you want to make it? Do you want to make it a 10 or do you want to make it a 15? What do you want? Side 10. Five. The Battle of Pita Kuli in 1682 was the last battle in a series of conflicts with the Mughals of which dynasty? The 600 year old dynasty came to an end in 1838 when the British annexed the kingdom. This is for team 2. 5 points if you give me the right time answer. Delhi Sultanate? Delhi Sultanate is wrong. The right answer Actually, it's quite unfortunate that you're missing this. The right answer is a home dynasty, a team from Gohati missing this. Oh dear. Next question. Okay. These postcards were introduced due to the popularity of Surbi. Now discontinued. What were these postcards called? Team 1. The Amul Surbi postcards. They were the um, Amul as the sponsor. Okay, Amul Sorbi postcards. No, that's the wrong answer. I'm afraid. Parvati Public School, you get a negative five. The right answer is competition postcards. Next question on the buzzer. Listen to the audio. <laughs> What sum of money did Renu or Mannu for his services? 5 rupai bara hai. 5 rupai yeah. That's the answer. Bara Ana. Very, very good. 5 points to you, team 1. I'm sure you're good at quizzing. Tell me what you want. 5 or 10? 10. You want a 10? Certain? Yeah? Okay. 10 points. This is for team 1. In 1958, N.K. Ferodia started his automobile manufacturing firm as Ferodia Blank Limited. It started production with the hand-seat three-wheelers. An image that should help you is there in front of you. Please fill in the blank. Eight. Say that again. Eight. 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 Is incorrect. The right answer is tempo. So that's three questions done in the third round. Let's take a look at the scorecard. Right, so that's nice to see. Actually, it's everybody who's still in the game. But at the moment, it's Team 4, Dan and Public School, Shimla, which is leading. While Team 3, Pavan's New Sprint Vidyale, which is still at 30. So 14, 30, 25, 20 and 15. Everybody's in the game. Nice to see. Two questions. First question, here it comes. If you're negotiating rapids called Ningwing, Pulsating Pulsi, Tooth Fairy, Knowing Madness and Cargo Killer, then you're rafting on what river? Team 5, DAV Public School, Jamshedpur. Your answer now. Brahmaputra. Very good answer with Brahmaputra. Super. Okay. 5 or 10? 10. 10. 10? 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10. 10
10 pointer. In 2000, the Tribune estimated the value of Takht e Taus at rupees 450 crores. Lost since the 18th century, how do we better know Takht e Taus? Uh, the big big old throne. The big old throne. Very good answer. Team 5, DAV Public School, Jamshedpur. Final question on your screen now. Which business organization was set up in 1927 at the advice of Mahatma Gandhi by G.D. Birla and Purushottam Das Thakur Das? Team 1, Bandhati Public School, Noida. For your answer, the Hindustan Times. Hindustan Times set up in 1927 by G.D. Birla. I'm afraid that's the wrong answer. This is not Hindustan Times. The right answer is Vicky. So that's the end of our exciting third semi-final. Here's a look at the scorecard. Oh, it's team four, the Anand Public School. Shimla, that has confirmed their position in the final. They finished with a score of 40, which was just about enough to take them through to the national final. Very, very well done. The other teams, I'm sure you've made your near and dear ones proud. That's it from all of us here at History TV 18. You were watching SPI Presents CBSC Heritage India Quiz 2014. We return next week in our hunt for the final national finalist. Do join us. In 2000, the Tribune estimated the value of Tak e Taus at rupees 450 crores. Lost since the 18th century, how do we better know Tak e Taus? Very good answer, Team 5, DAV Public School, Jamshedpur. CBSC Heritage India School.